Hello again, everybody. Now, do you remember that last week we spoke about Bernard, the bee, and he got trapped in the flower? Well, this week, this story is about Bellamy, the bee that found him. Bellamy was quiet for many days. He had never seen a bee that was dead before and wasn't sure how to respond. Bernard may have been a very proud bee and a very silly bee at times, but Bellamy still missed him. But Bellamy too was proud. He didn't want anyone to think that he was unable to cope with the death of his friend. He flew around as he always had done. He collected pollen as he always had done. But his heart wasn't in it. He was feeling very bad inside. On the outside, however, Bellamy still tried to look as if everything was fine. He hadn't want his friends to see how he really felt. It was a shame that Bellamy didn't show them, because they were all feeling the same way. Everyone missed Bernard. But most of the bees were prepared to show it. Betsy burst into tears now and then, and some of the other bees held a special service to say goodbye to Bernard. But Bellamy didn't go. He was trying to deal with it by himself. It wasn't going to work. Soon Bellamy became very moody and angry with everyone. He wouldn't come out to play, he didn't want to mix with the others, and he was getting more and more miserable. You see, it's not wrong to feel sad sometimes. We mustn't walk around looking miserable all the time, but we also don't need to pretend to be happy when actually we're sad. Bellamy just got worse and worse. He stopped eating, he stopped talking, and he even stopped flying. The whole thing could have ended in disaster, except that one day the queen of the hive, Queen Belinda Bee, summoned Bellamy to her rooms. Bellamy was feeling terrible, but he didn't dare not go. He walked into the Queen's room and sat down. The Queen looked him straight in the eyes and then began to shout at him. You have been a very foolish bee, Bellamy. You are sad, you feel bad, you miss Bernard. So do we all. Bellamy began to cry. And when the Queen mentioned the name Bernard, Bellamy began to sob uncontrollably. He cried and cried for some time. And then after he had cried, he felt better. You see, it's okay to feel sad sometimes. Another story next week. <laughs>